We're checking out this Resident Evil showcase. I'm not the biggest Resident Evil fan, just so you know. I've played quite a few, but I'm not into the lore, and I'm not going to know all the Easter eggs. I'm going to oh my god, that's that's this guy from the second game in that one scene. I don't, I'm not going to know that, all right? Just going into this, know that. I hope Leon Kennedy shows up. Okay, I didn't know, I wasn't sure what was gonna happen. I'm excited for Resident Evil Village. I'm very excited. I love Resident Evil 7 so much, and it's kind of continuing that style of Resident Evil, it seems like. But we're getting way more off into, like, a paranormal vibe in Resident Evil. We started kind of grounded with science with, like, oh, this virus hey, is caused by... Thank Hold you on, this so lady's talking. Thank you so much for joining us today, and welcome to our Resident Evil Showcase. I'm your host, Brittany Brombacher, here to give Hi, you Brittany. a closer <laughs> look into what Capcom has coming up for the Resident Evil How are you? franchise. We'll be kicking things off with some brand new content and... Oh my god, the big titty vampire wife. Woo! <laughs> I'm already buying the game after that. That's what everyone is. You sold us. That's it. Just just show a picture of that and say, buy this, and then we'll be okay. Yes, yes, ma'am. But yeah, it was kind of grounded in reality before, but now we've got like paranormal stuff going on and everything. It's kind of weird. I heard, she, I heard the big titty wife who was a vampire, so I don't know. That's why I said that, but I think I think she is. I'm not sure. I don't know. Talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I don't know. I don't know really anything about this. I didn't look at any of the leaks. I didn't look at nothing. It was all fresh to me. I've only seen the last trailer that they made. The game looks amazing, like beautiful. It looks so good. The Resident Evil engine. Magnifique. It looks doesn't look that great because we're streaming it right now, but trust me, it looks good. I'm, I'm thinking that this lady right here is like the main villain. I'm not sure. But goddamn, she is thick, boy. <laughs> crank the seat back for that one. Jesus! I need to stop doing that. Yes. God damn, she's hot. What do you want me to do? I won't let you down. She's mad too. Oh my god. Can someone say look how good that looks? Oh my god. No. The place is full of nothing but blood and death. Oof. Scary. I like the first person point of view for Resident Evil. I feel like it's more like immersive. Like I feel like I'm in there. I'm like, oh my god. What's behind me? I don't know. The, more so than the third person. And who, who are these guys? They're wearing... Okay, he's got a sword. This thing's got a sword. That's what I'm saying. See, what is this? Like she's, she's... A million moths into a person? It's super paranormal now. It's really weird. Resident Evil went off in that direction, but I guess it's cool. You know, it works. It's horror, whatever. Let's have some fun. A baby. I love babies. And my wife, who's back. Okay. There you are. I'm right here. <laughs> Oof. She looked excited. That looks really cool. I can't wait. To, I cannot wait to play this. This is gonna be a fantastic experience, uh, and I'm sure a polished one as well. Let's see what you're really made of. Ethan. And we got the classic. Uh, trope of a small guy with a big thing on his back like how can he carry that that thing's so big oh that's the stampede looking at as boy um i don't mind it though that guy looks cool i guess like van helsing or some shit i don't know but i still have so many questions no you don't you are hired by the company you don't have any questions why do they gotta talk to us like that like we're dumb or something i don't know jesus christ just say we're gonna go to pete fabiano for some answers hey pete fabiano producer on resident evil village when we first announced Resident Evil Village back in June, we only mentioned PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, and PC. I'm happy to announce... Switch! It's coming to Switch! Yes! Yes! Streaming version! Can't wait, dude. Resident Evil Village will also be coming to PlayStation 4... You can play an inferior version! Yay! Awesome! PS4 version can be upgraded free upgrade. for free to the digital PS5 version. Okay, that's cool, I guess. I mean, it's kind of like they have to do it, right? You bought the game, right? I don't, I don't know how it works. I don't know how none of that works. But great, now you can play it on PS4 and Xbox One. Okay, we got a release date. May 7th. Okay, that's not too far off. All right. 
Could held off to Halloween, but a you know fun time to experience. But you know whatever. May that's great. You're like I don't want to wait. Just saying. Oh, they got the save device. The tape. The tape deck is back. The mystery everywhere. Oh, this is the same exact stuff from Resident Evil Seven. The tragedy of Ethan Winters. Oh, is it the same guy? Ethan Winters is the same guy from Resident Evil Seven. Oh, okay. I remember his name being Ethan. I haven't played it recent. I did play it a little recently, actually, but not enough to remember that it was Ethan Winters. I want that Chris figure. I never buy the deluxe. It's just a bunch of junk. I don't need it. I just want to play the game. Oh, that's cool. So they are just directly uh, linked. I didn't know that. That's interesting. Mr. Raccoon. And their survival a lot of pre-order bonuses. God damn. Support during the first few hours of gameplay. Finally, digital pre-orders from the PlayStation Store will receive an exclusive Resident Evil Village mini soundtrack. Okay. A lot of pre-order bonuses. I don't want any of it. Don't. I just want the game. That's it. I know you've been waiting for this. It's time for the world premiere first look at Resident Evil Village gameplay. Alongside this, let's first check look, it out. Pete Fabiano back to offer some insights as well. Great. Let's take a look. We're gonna have a let's watch along with a let's watch your er, There's multiple layers of this. Let's go, baby. Now we're here to give you an exclusive first look. Oh, yeah, we just heard. Resident we literally Evil just heard. Just like in Resident Evil 7 Biohazard, you'll be taking control of Ethan Winters. He just went full on into the whole thing, huh? Village to the castle. Players will need to get in and search for their kidnapped daughter. Ethan's just having a rough life, dude. First is his girlfriend, then his daughter. Jesus. person perspective. I like the first person perspective, like I said. Detailed world we've created. Some people don't. Some people are like, oh, it's not classic. Ugh. Sorry, just me. You'll see a lot of those little details come to life here. Streaming again, so it doesn't look as good as it should. It's kind of pixelated. So excuse me. It's not the game. A ton of effort into creating a truly authentic feel. From art design to God, it looks so good. Jesus Christ. Boy, that RE team knows how to polish a game, don't they? Whoo-wee! Uh oh, scary. Now it's time to meet some of the castle denizens. As you'd expect, a warm welcome's not really what's in store for Ethan. Yep, I got a scythe. And those are locusts, maybe, I guess? Oh, I'm dead. Ethan's getting fucked up all the time! How's he alive? Man, blood. Oh, a bunch of babes, though. They could, they could hit me with a sickle, I guess. Bug it. I'm down. Ooh, and the ultimate waifu. Now, let's take a look at him. Ethan Winters, you escaped Bunch of my babes. idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Okay. I feel like this game doesn't look as scary as Seven did. That the the house, the Baker house, or I think that was the name in Seven. It was really scary. It doesn't look that scary, but that that looks like it might be kind of scary. That little really dark corridor. I don't know, but I feel like it's. I don't know. The other one maybe was scary. I don't know. Just what I'm getting so far. Ooh, I like that shoddy. Each type of enemy has their own Jesus, a gigantic troll man? And he's got the hammer too? Is that the same guy, maybe? Maybe it's the same guy. Maybe he like transforms into that. Of course. Come on. How you gonna miss? Like six feet away from it. Some of you will remember a similar management system in Resident Evil 4. Mm -hmm. This time around, Looks good. I like it. Which allows you to create items such as first aid and ammo. We got a. Oh, okay. There's also I'm really liking this right here. This is nice looking. Game. This is gonna be a good ass game, boy. I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winters. Jesus! You know Some real fucking characters in this thing. Jesus! Oh, my God. oh, is he like the merchant? The merchant makes a return. Oh, there we go. This but he got—he gained some weight. The Duke. Jesus Christ, boy. Let himself go. To buy and sell weapons, amongst other things. 
You can level your weapons up again. Oh, that's cool. I like that. You'll often find him in different situations. Each Damn, this looks so cool, dude. He's an interesting fella. Smash away with your trusty knife. Of course. There's plenty of items to find in your trap. Ooh, we got a herb. We're swimming in a blood pond. Wait. Hepatitis, here we come, baby. And we've also got extra objectives outside of the main ones. Of course, it goes without saying that there'll be plenty of puzzles to solve for players to move forward. Resident Evil puzzles are always pretty goddamn easy. Plenty of surprises to keep you on your toes. Ah! Ah! Oh no! Oh! I can barely see her. It's just pi it's just pixels on my screen. <laughs> Ooh, they're impervious to bullets. Well, that's one way to end the video. <laughs> LOL. Now that we've shown you what's in store for Resident Evil Village, uh -huh. let's take a look at the exclusive PlayStation 5 demo. <laughs> oh, we got a console exclusive demo. That's great. PlayStation 5 exclusive. I don't have a PlayStation 5, so guess I'll wait. <laughs> For this demo, cool. Players won't be playing as Ethan, but as a character we're referring to as the Maiden. Unlike the actual game, this experience doesn't feature combat or even blocking. That's cool. He's touting it like it's cool. He said, You can't do anything in this but walk around. <laughs> Isn't that sick? It's like a separate story, I guess. It's a demo only thing. Maybe we'll get to play it later when the We're game comes out. I don't know. Get a real feel for the visuals and audio as they take the maiden on her journey to find a way out of the castle. And you can download the exclusive demo on PlayStation 5 today. Great. Of course. Fantastic. So everyone hit up the scalpers. So we'll have a separate new demo available. Oh, a different demo? Ready for sometime this spring. You guys are dicks. This year marks the 25th anniversary of the Resident Evil franchise, with the very first game releasing in Japan back on March 22nd, 1996. Since then, the series has expanded well beyond the Looks like Happy Console games. Gamer's wife. Toys I don't remember her name. To CG movies, to live action Just saying. Films. Resident Evil has become a cultural icon. Resident Evil continues to offer surprises around every corner, so let's pass it along to producer Yoshi Kanda to hear more about what you can expect. More Resident Evil coming! Yay! Resident Evil 4 remake? Who knows? I don't know. Earlier this month, oh. we started inviting players to join a Claus beta test. Mm -hmm. The test won't happen until later next week, but I want to use this chance to reveal more details. With okay. the 25th anniversary of Resident Evil coming on March 22nd, we are excited to celebrate this milestone with our fans. Last September, we showed off a piece of key art showcasing some of Resident Evil's iconic characters to start the celebration. He keeps looking around. Now, He's like, I'm happy to announce what was behind that. Let's take a look. Okay, world premiere. What the hell is this? Telltale Games Resident Evil 2? RE vs Resident Evil. What the fuck is this? This looks dumb. Ooh, ooh, ooh I don't like this. Ooh, 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 ooh. First of all, it looks. Oh, that was Jack. Uh, it looks so garbage on my computer streaming. <laughs> RE vs Resident Evil. Why is Jack in the middle? Like he's okay. Is one of the ways we're celebrating the 25th anniversary of the franchise, showcasing so many of the characters that fans love. Okay. It'll be available for free to anyone who purchases Resident Evil Village. So be sure to follow the. Is Resident anybody Evil gonna want to play this? It looks so random. And check out the official website for even more details. I don't care. Not even a bit. Not even a tiny. Not even a smidge. 
Another world premiere. Oh, Ubisoft? Something to do with Resident Evil and Ubisoft? We can't wait to get our hands on our reverse. Lion, look at him just lying through his teeth. Oh, okay. Well, crossover. The iconic outfits and items from the original Resident Evil trilogy. Everyone that logs in during the event will get Leon Kennedy's Raccoon Police Department outfit as a warm up. That's kind of cool. I mean, I don't play the game, but it's kind of cool. We don't need to see it, though. I trust you. I mean, it's cool. Like I said, it's cool, but like, I'm not ever going to play it. And like, who really cares? Division 2? Like, is that, does anybody, I don't know. I don't know. Does anybody care? Maybe they do. Maybe you do. Maybe like, are you serious right now? Are you kidding me? Okay. Hi. Infinite Darkness? The 3D CGI animated film? Oh, it's a movie. Okay. That'll be cool. That'll be cool. I heard there's a Resident Evil Netflix show coming, so maybe they'll talk about that. That's what I heard. I don't know. Leon looking sharp in a suit. Oh, Netflix. Maybe this is what I was. Maybe this is what I was heard about. Cool. Looking forward to it. Thank you. Thank you. Already got the Gizimas. But if you missed anything along the way, don't worry. Keep an eye on the Resident Evil social channels and official Thanks, Happy Console Gamer's Wife. Everything from today. Thank you. As a quick Congratulations on the child. Resident Evil Village is available for pre-order starting today for the PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X, Xbox One, and Steam for PC. And don't forget, PlayStation 5 owners get a sneak peek. We just watched it. We really need a recap like this. It has been an absolute honor <laughs> to celebrate the amazing Resident Evil leading that looks terrible. Like, who cares about that? Some cell shaded host, multiplayer battle Until Resident Evil game, game looked terrible. Forgotten about in a month, guaranteed. Like, oh, you play that? Nasty bitch. That's what I'm gonna be saying. Well, there you go. That's that was the showcase. Great. Resident Evil Village looks incredible. We didn't get really anything else besides that. They said, we're gonna show you the future of Resident Evil franchise right here. Netflix, Tom Clancy's Division 2, and a shitty mobile-looking game. Check it out, guys. So there you go. I don't know. If you liked the video, leave a like. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Subscribe if you haven't already. Links to everything in the description. Patreon, merch, store, all that fun stuff. We have a join button. Great ways to support the channel, all that stuff. I also put a pinned comment down below. The other channels I work on, we're also on BitChute, Library, and Rumble. Check us out over there, and I'll see you later. So I want to say thank you to your loyalty. Thank you for your support.